just arrived in Lincoln. I am so excited to be back. This morning's been a bit hectic, so I haven't really filmed much, but me and my dad are just unloading the car and bringing everything in. This is only like a tiny amount of what's outside, but it's ridiculous. Is that it? Um, oh. Another at least two lots. Really? Okay. I have literally bought tons of stuff, like way too much stuff. Right, I think it's time for an update. So my dad has left and I'm stuck with all this mess, but he really nicely made my bed for me, which is so lovely of him. Um, but yeah, I've got like so much stuff to sort out. So I'm procrastinating a little bit. I've just edited my vlog that's going up today. And yeah, I just thought I'd have a little chat. It's so weird being back in Lincoln. I'm pretty sure no one else is here. I know Hattie's not, but I haven't spoke to anyone else since the Christmas break. I'm just, I just feel a little bit weird. Like I'm back at uni. I'm back at uni and now I'm just here until March. I am going home. I'm going to London towards the end of January for an event and I'm going at the beginning like sort of in the beginning of February for Aiden's birthday and then the next one I'm going home is March the 3rd for my orthodontist appointment so I'm literally not going home for like three months which is insane and then I have my exams that are starting in two days which again is like ugh but yeah uh I th everything's just a little bit stressful again I had a green tea that was so good like, I forgot how much I actually liked green tea um, and I had these like organic biscuits, they're like organic triple chocolate cookies and I was thinking oh they're gonna taste gross but they actually tasted nice and they're pretty healthy for you so I'm feeling very happy about that. But yeah I need to sort all this stuff out and I just don't want to. <laughs> I also need to film my semester A roundup for tomorrow's video as well which is exciting. But Megan's just messaged me and said she's just arrived in Lincoln so she's going to sort her, all her stuff out and then she's going to come around I'm going to have a little revision session so hopefully you can we'll like talk you through what we're doing revision wise and I might get Megan to see if um I might get Megan to have a chat with you about her course because you might be interested in psychology and give you a bit of an insight into her subject rather than just listening to mine all the time because I you might be getting a bit bored of me talking about it. I'm not really sure um just let me know know what you want to hear about because I'm obviously filming my video and stuff but yeah it's so weird being back but I'm so excited for this semester and hopefully it's even better than semester A. I do need to go and collect the post so hopefully the post office is open and I can go and do that because I have a feeling I have a lot of parcels. So I haven't vlogged in absolutely ages. Megan came around and we did some work in like my kitchen like no one's back at my flats apart from me so me and Megan are staying here tonight. I've just put a bubble mask on by the way and it's so itchy. Um, uh. Megan's just putting hers on over there. But I think I'm going to combine this vlog with tomorrow's vlog because I haven't really done much today or just videoed it really. So I'll see you tomorrow. It's Sunday the 7th of January. It is now three o'clock. <laughs> okay, we woke up about, I think I woke up about half 10, but I just sat for like two hours on the sofa. We slept in the kitchen. Oh shit, that's a yeah, we've just been lazing around this morning and we just took a trip to Home Bargains to buy stuff because I literally didn't buy anything <coughs> with my family before I came, so I just thought I'd do a little food haul. Mm. So first of all, I got two packets of pita breads because I thought I could use these to like... Oh, I forgot to explain. Me and Megan are going on a health kick starting Monday, tomorrow. And we're not eating any more shit, so we decided to get some like healthier things so I got pizza bread because I thought that could like a good snack like if I just toasted them and maybe put marmite on or just ate it like plain chips and then I got some porridge oats so that I could thicken my smoothies because Megan said that's a good tip so I need to buy some frozen fruit some point during the week but these will be good and I might try porridge again because remember the last time I tried it, it was disgusting but I'll try it again and hope I like it also, I also bought some cheap bread um, as well for breakfast. Uh, I bought some Pro Plus caffeine tablets because my sleeping pattern's already shit so it's going to get even worse and I need these for when I'm doing my exams or waking up early for lectures. Two litres of semi-skimmed milk so me and Megan could have some tea and stuff. I think half of my flatmates are not coming back for another two weeks because they don't have exams but um, 
Hattie's coming back today, but she'll still be like, she'll be like an owl, won't she? Um, yeah, I've got some milk for us. Obviously, Hattie, I can't have a look, she's a little lactose cream now. Um, oh, yeah. I've got some crunchy nut, um, what are they called? Just crunchy nut flakes, or just oh, crunchy really? nut? Crunchy nut corn flakes for breakfast, because I thought that would be a nice treat, because it's like sweet. It's probably not the most healthiest of cereals, but it's probably my only like sweet thing I can bought. Yeah. Um, then I bought these tomato cup of soup things because they were like, it was like 80p for four sachets, so I was like, that's good. Yeah. Hopefully that tastes nice. <coughs> I'll be living off soup. And I bought tons of pasta, obviously, because carbs. I bought like two lots of penne, so like them together was like a pound. Then I got some pasta sauce. How do you pronounce this? Napoli Napolina? Yes, Napolina tomato and chilli sauce because it's so good and it's only like 80p as well. But then I got some hair bubbles because I literally packed some and I can't find them anywhere. And I've, I hate having my hair done when I sleep, especially like, it was, it was horrible last night. And then finally, for our last cheat day of the year, of the year, <laughs> our last cheat day before we go health, healthy as fur, I decided to get lemon cake because it was only a pound. It was really fun and all this food was £10.80 which is insane so we need to definitely go to Home Bargains more. We'll probably go when Hattie comes like during the week because she loves it. Okay we're, we're gonna make yeah we're gonna make some breakfast or brunch or it's kind of not it's even too late for brunch. It's like evening. Yeah it's like almost dark so yeah we better start making something. Let's go. <laughs> now I have to pull this away. That's the worst part. Okay, so it is a little while later, it is half ten. We've not really been doing much today, obviously me and Megan came back yesterday uh, and today we went to the sh we, to, today we went to the shop and you saw my little haul earlier. Hope you like that, I, quite a lot of people have been saying they want more food hauls on my channel so I'm going to try and get that up as much as I can whenever I go food shopping or whenever me and my friends go to the, like, to a supermarket or whatever. Today has been more catching up with everyone, like me, Hattie and Megan have been trying to revise but we've been mainly catching up and having a laugh. We do have our first exams tomorrow, Hattie and Megan have a psychology, one of their psychology exams at 4 till 6 tomorrow which is again a really weird time, like over dinner. And then I have mine 7 till 8 which is going to be exhausting but I'm going to probably vlog tomorrow and then tell you how everything goes. I think it'll be quite nice to see my level of panic day as obviously I've got the whole day to panic and worry which is the main reason why I hate my exam being so late I'm gonna be worrying throughout the entire day which is gonna be so annoying but I'm gonna to have to get over it because I can do nothing to change it uh so yeah um I hope you enjoyed this vlog it has been a little two day one of me coming back to uni and trying to settle back in it's been so strange I hope you like my semester roundup video that me and Megan filmed the other night and uplo I uploaded to my vlog channel if you haven't already I'll link it down below and it's and it'll be the video before this one um thank you again for watching hit the thumbs up if you did enjoy subscribe down below if you're new and I will see you tomorrow for another vlog night